Hey, 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 Festy Man reporting. A little bit late. Um, it's now Monday afternoon and uh, it's, no, it's not taking me that long to recover. I've been really tired. But the word out on the street is I was fucking hammered and I deserve to be. You know, it's been two years now and uh, oh, it was amazing. Southampton sings for Ukraine. But just the fact of going out, um, which was strange going into town, Southampton, because that is no longer my town centre. It's strange, really, because I live in here in Gosport, and people say about town, and I think, town? What are you going to Southampton for? But they have their town here. Sorry, I'm just plugging you in. But to go in and uh, meet up with me old buddy Myth, the blues legend, go and have a few beers. We dropped off the um, the gear in the platform. Had a beer in there, walked down to the uh, Dancing Man, sampled their new beer. Uh, strange name, something about monkeys with odd shaped balls. <laughs> Shouldn't be slapping them on your granny's ass, something like that. But it did have a really nice little um, bite of coconut to it, but still not as good as liquid gold. Uh, but rather, anyway, great. Dino Matthias turned up. Um, magic, magic, magic. And we spent the rest of the day in the, the platform. We didn't go round to um, the rest of the city to see the other bands, but there was a full day um, at, at the platform. And forgive me, forgive me, please forgive me, because, because I can't um, remember all the names of the bands playing there, apart from Backwater Roll Blues Band, who were the last band on. Unfair to say they were headlining. Um, and supporting, sorry, not supporting them. The band before them were the really wonderful Chicago Nine, Mel, Steve, and the others. Lovely seeing you. Uh, but what a fabulous, fabulous day it really was. It was just a musical day. But the beauty of it was, especially for me and probably for a lot of other people, it was my first big day out. And faces, it's a bit like going to a school reunion and you see faces you've forgotten. Um, and it was wonderful. And I am so sorry that if I was that hammered. I know I was a, a happy, friendly drunk and probably falling all over people. I know I had to get off the dance floor because I was going to in danger of falling into the band. So I, I, I got off that. But no, I had a marvellous time. And, you know, as I say, I'm sorry if... Um, people I spoke to, if I mumbled at you, I spat on you, whatever... Um, but it keeps coming back now. People I, I spoke to, and oh Christ, yeah, 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 they were there, they were there, and it, it still is. So I think I've got about 50% memory recall. Um, but Chicago Nine were wonderful, they're really, really good. I mean, we all love Mel, he's a great bloke, and Steve Brennan has got to be one of the best guitars in this area he really has lovely guy but he's just got a real lovely style and then the moment we were all being waiting for well no it wasn't it was just like the climax of a great day backwater old blues band and they just picked up where they left off fuck knows what miss worried about he knows that once he gets on there gets that up in his mouth gets that mic he becomes the blues legend you know so uh it, it was just great seeing them there and um, it was just a blur really. I know I've got some video of it, um, probably some videos of me going about somewhere, but uh, no, it was just, oh, and I've spoken to people since and they're all saying how they're suffering. Um, I wasn't too bad actually. I was quite worried. I was quite worried because I've been out of practice and uh, the last couple of times I'd had a few beers, I've gotten a bit wavy. You know, I've got that old angry bit, I've got that angry bit, didn't I? Which you used to have when you was a kid. And, uh, but I think it was all just to do with the mental pressure of... You no, know, you weren't being locked in, but it just seems as though... If you're a social animal, that that had been taken away from you. And it really was like being in prison, you know. So, um, only metaphorically. Uh, but, no, it was just... Oh, it was just such a relief and... Uh, it was just a wonderful, wonderful day that we ever held out for us, which didn't really make any difference because um, we were inside. What more can I say, though? You know, all the bands were great, and there was a lovely band on in the afternoon. They did a lot of oldies, a lot of Eric Clapton um, 
tributes. I'm sorry, I can't remember your name. I probably didn't know your name in the first place. Miff knew you all and probably introduced me, but I just... No, it was fabulous, fabulous, fabulous day. Um, I didn't do a lot of videos. Um, I got out of the habit of doing that. I even bought this phone here because it's got a very superior video camera on it, but I didn't do it. Um, but it still keeps me looking. <laughs> Super fantastic. But I'd just like to say hello. Thank you all for everybody who come down to see me. <laughs> bump into me whether you wanted to or not and i hope you all had as much fun as i did thank you Miff, for your hospitality and let me sleep at your your place and hello to claire your your girlfriend your new girlfriend or oh, you're not a new girlfriend anymore is it see time passes we've had that we've been in that time capsule haven't we so i'm looking forward to um a summer of love, a summer filled with music and dancing with people, getting drunk. Oh, just, there you go. See, talking about that, Gabe was there. Gabe, he's got a Gabe Fest. Gabe, if I spoke to you about Gabe Fest, you'll have to remind me. I'm sure I did. I just, I was chatting shit. <laughs> I know I was. I know I was. I know I must have been because I ain't got a clue. It was nothing important. Because I would have remembered that. But, um, yeah. So, uh, anyway. I'm off now. I'm off shopping. Replenish the stocks. And uh, I will see you all soon. It's been my pleasure. Peace out. Can you feel the love? <laughs>